Let us see how to make Mediterranean cucumber tomato salad. This is a really easy salad to make and requires no cooking at all. First take half red onion and slice it thinly. We are going to just use the slivers. Then you can take English cucumbers and we are going to cube them into equal sizes. What I do is cut it into half and then as you can see I cube it like this. Uh, I have left the peel on because these are English cucumbers. In case you are using cucumbers with thicker peels, I'd suggest that you peel them. Now these cucumbers don't really have very, you know, they have tender seeds and uh, don't have thick seeds. In case your cucumbers have thick seeds or you don't like seeds, feel free to take them out. In a bowl, take your diced uh, cucumbers and uh, onion slices. I just, you know, take them out so so that we get nice slivers and not th uh, big mouthfuls of onion when we are having this salad. Take uh, tomatoes, remove their uh, stem part, and again we are going to dice them into cubes. In any salad, it is important that you cut the vegetables in equal sizes. Not only do they look beautiful that way, but they also taste better as they all uh, uniformly absorb the dressing which we use in the salad. So we go ahead and uh, dice two to three tomatoes for the salad. This Mediterranean salad is really very simple and versatile. Feel free to add any other vegetables that you like in your salad. Now add the, your diced tomatoes into the bowl. We are go going to now add salt and pepper. Uh, we'll mix everything well and let this sit with the vegetables for two to three minutes. This helps uh, the vegetables get absorb the salt as well as release some water and they become nice and crispy. Once we have finished that, we'll add our dressing which is basically extra virgin olive oil for its beautiful nutty taste. We used two tablespoon and two tablespoon of red wine vinegar. Uh, for its lovely tart taste. Then we nicely mix the salad uh, and let it marinate in this dressing. Then we top up with half cup of pitted olives. This gives it, some, it a wonderful Mediterranean flavor. Use I've used green olives. You can use red, black olives here as well. Top it up with some parsley or cilantro and 